Hey guys, Parfax here, and today we're talking about making money, getting umbral shards, all without leaving town. All right, let's get started. All right, today we are talking about making money and getting umbral shards all without leaving your cozy little abode. So what we are doing here, we're not crafting, we're not gathering, we're salvaging. All right, now I will say that we will be putting up a clip of me buying stuff because honestly, I've bought a lot off the market recently but we will uh, buy one or two off the market so I can show you what's going on and show you how you can basically sit in town while getting money and while getting umbral shards. All right, so what the first thing you want to do here, that is some of the stuff we're going to get right there, is we want to go over here to the filters and all we want to do is type in 600 and apply that filter the reason is we want to look at these juicy legendary items now when i started this you're going to see in the clip here at the end these were a lot cheaper but because i've bought them out they are a little bit more expensive so we're gonna buy these drums now what you want cc 563 is how much it cost us so what you really want to buy here is you want to buy Anything I say right around the 500 mark that is crafted. So we don't want the Primeval Warhammer. We don't want the Ancient Musket, the Profane Hat, the Ancient Cloth Shoes. We want crafted items. Now we can go down here. We're starting to get pretty high. Let's look here to file leather coat. A lot of drums. A lot of these drums are what I've bought. Uh, we're gotten to the point now where I'm not going to buy any of these, but you will find a lot of gear down here as well. So let's go ahead and go to the inventory and let's show you what I'm talking about. So we're gonna deconstruct these. And we got two glittery and ebony, two perfect salvage and 50 umbral shards. So right off the bat, we can look at glitter and ebony. It has dropped a tad, but we can look it up here glittering ebony and it's going for 226 so let's round that down even with taxes let's say 200 a piece it's not that much so we got 400 out of the 600 we need so we're a little bit low here and we're like man what are we gonna do well let's go to the uh where is it at the wood or the workshop here and we can turn that engineer's scraps. We can turn those into as a modium. So let's go here. We'll go to the workshop and we can extract two of these and 250 Azoth into one as modium ingot or one glittering ebony. You can also do two and get one runic leather, but as modium is the most expensive. So we're going to go ahead and do one. All right, let's close that out. Let's go ahead and open it up. And we got one as modium. So you can even sell if you don't have like, let's say you don't have a lot of the Azoth. You can sell these scraps on the marketplace. I actually sold a bunch of them because I don't have a whole lot of Azoth on this character. But if you don't want to sell them, you can just turn them into as modium. This is essentially three shards while still making money. If you can get them for 400, for 500, even for 550, any of that crafted stuff, you're doing well. Now, I will say that every once in a while, you will get one, as you're going to see in the clip. But you're going to make up for it by just getting the other, you know, the infused fragments. I had it the first time I did this to where... The glittering ebony was covering the complete cost of the item, and I was just getting uh, two fragments for every time I deconstructed it and 50 umbral shards. So essentially, I was netting about one, I was netting almost 300 coins and 50 umbral shards per item bought. So it was pretty crazy. I will show you the clip here after this. So make sure you look at the trading post 
or try to buy stuff from the trade market that you know right on the trade channel that allows you to well make some money and to get some umbral shards all right guys thanks for watching like comment subscribe like always and i'll see you in the next one peace